Hi folks, today we are going to take you around our little mini homestead here and we are going to go and tap some trees. That's going to be our first time. Now my stepfather did hook us up with two of the plastic tree tappers and we do have more than two trees on the property so we're going to make some homemade ones. Come check it out. You doing the maple or the birch? Oh no, the plastic tap I gotta put in the tree. Okay, maple tree. Two on this tree. Maple sap. Tis the season. So after you do the first side, then you flip her over and do the other side. One more hole to make now. Let's make. So we have the initial hole in the dowel going all the way through. So we have this small hose from a, a kit. It was like a super soaker kit from I think the dollar store that I never used. So just match it up with your drill bit. And this is the other hole that we have to make to Oops. insert this into our homemade tree tapper. Let's do it. As far as you can get it. I, I wouldn't drill no more. Yeah, it's gonna crack. Yeah, I wouldn't drill it no more. Okay, so now we gotta just get the tube in there. Yes. Okay. Okay, it's in. Now we're just gonna secure it with some tape. Where's the tape? I get it. In the workshop. Go Toronto, go, hey Stitch. Let's see your concoction. Nice. Ready for the tree. Okay, so now we are going to the tree. We gotta tap the tree. So these are the same diameter. So what we have to do is tape this at an inch and a half so that we don't go too far into the tree. So let's do it. We got two measuring tapes. <laughs> okay, so an inch and a half right there. Okay. 
You doing the maple or the birch? Maple. The one that has damage? Okay. You want to do that one? Yes. Yeah. Okay. No, we need to drill. All right, we are at the south side of the tree because this is what is recommended for when you are tapping. And this is our maple. It's a good size. So I'm going to start off with the small bit. All three bits are marked. And if you can come closer, you can see that when the tree is going to heal, the water will flow down and heal, heal from our tapping area. So I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually go up in here. Do it a couple more times, I'd ream it. Yeah. See, it's sticky, eh? Yeah. <sighs> a little more, and then ream it. Try and clean it. Well, might have to whittle that, but don't have to tap it with the hammer or anything. Now we need a hole in the bucket. Yes. I used to whittle it once. Uh, no, it's go to the black. Quite a bit so far. So this is what we have after two days from the trees. And we're gonna need a lot more than this, folks. So this is our trial and error for this year. Because you need a ratio of 50 to one. So 50 of these will make one, one container when you boil it down. Stay tuned for that video. Thank you for watching everyone.